Hi everyone, this is Laura and today I'm bringing you a layout that I completed. And this layout that I did, I used a very old Stampin' Up! Um, paper collection. So, real quick, um, the layout is about my daughter, Alicia, and this was a few years ago when she was a lot younger, and <laughs> little Miss Alicia, well, actually both my daughters, they went through this really big phase where they just loved wearing sunglasses. OMG, they just used to love wearing their sunglasses, and this little peanut she had on her sunglasses and she was jumping up and down dancing on mommy's bed um, and she had an attack of the sillies and I think it was due to the sunglasses she just thought she was so cute she had to go flipping and twirling and showing off her little sunglasses so that's the title of the layout I'm too cute with my sunglasses because she was so darn cute um, and I'm so glad I actually caught her um, we don't ever want to catch our children jumping on the beds, but this time it was forgiven because she was just too cute. So real quick, on the top of my layout here, <clears throat> I have a piece of lace. Um, it's about a quarter inch lace that I have. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, guys. My throat is still kind of funny. I have running across the top and over here using a uh, car stock that came with the paper collection that I also bought. Um, I have this Martha Stewart floral deep edge punch and I distressed everything with the vintage photo. In the center of the flowers I have some little white flat back pearls that I added. Over here I just um, made a little red bow I also scallop punch with my Friskars punch a border here using the red cardstock. I added some of my red thickers for the title. And um, I'm not too sure of what the name of this font is. I don't really pay attention to the fonts too much, sorry. <laughs> um, the photos themselves, I have backed it also on that red cardstock. And on this one, I also have a uh, green and red cardstock. <coughs> Excuse me. Over here, I have some Prima flowers in different shades of green. And I also have some of these pearl buttons that are from my stash. Very vintage -y. These came from my grandma. And over here, I have a... Um, petal of flower inside a prima flower. Over here I have some more prima flowers again with some of those little vintage buttons. Over here I have a photo anchor in green and this is my little journal spot. And again um, I can come back later and either add some more um, pictures of sunglasses or photos or more journaling and over here, <coughs> I have this big journal spot that came from a stamp that Elvira gave me. Thank you so much, Elvira. That has become one of my most favorite um, journal uh, spot stamps, only because it's so big and it gives me so much room to journal. Some more of those petal flowers. Again, I distressed everything with vintage photo. I used my... Um, scallop shaped scissors to cut these out. Yep, those old school scissors. I don't know if you guys remember them. <laughs> and over here on this photo, I added some red polka dot um, ribbon trim to the bottom and top. And I have these little green heart shaped brads. They weren't green, but I colored them with my alcohol ink markers. And I made them green so they can um, match the layout. And this is just the date. So that's my layout of my little baby girl going crazy silly with her little sunglasses on, jumping on mama's bed. I hope you all enjoyed and have a blessed Monday. Thank you all for watching. Bye.